Hey, how are y'all doing? Um, I know that whenever I've tried to get sober in the past and, and quit my addiction and the days and weeks leading up to me quitting, there would always be something, you know, just stuck in my head that would discourage me and it was just my fear of being sober. I was scared of sobriety. Um, now, if you're going through this, I will say that it is normal to be scared of being sober if you are an alcoholic or if you were a problem drinker or a heavy drinker, whatever you want to call it. Um, whenever you have done something for so long and you're so used to it, uh, it becomes every part of you. It is scary to think of your life without it. You have really mixed up the chemical imbalance in your brain and you know you have gotten your way of life so wrapped around alcohol that it is scary to think about your life without it. Think about what you've used it for. You drank whenever you were happy. You drank whenever you were sad. Um, you drank just to drink. And any sporting thing that came up, you drank. Any uh, movie you watched, you drank. Um, any situation, for me, I, I looked for every excuse to do it. I'm not going to beat around the bush. I did. And whenever I get sober, it's just a kind of a scary thought. And that's one reason you have to take sobriety one day at a time. You can't. You can't sit here and think about, I'm never going to have a drink again. Oh my God, I, no, I can't do it. You have to take it one day at a time. That's one of the reasons you got to do that. Because if you look too far down the line, you're not worrying about today and you're not living in the present, you, you're probably going to mess up. Um, I'm not one of those guys that's, that is huge on not counting your days of sobriety, but that's one of the things you don't need to worry about is how many days you've been sober because it almost gives you... Um, that excuse in the end to say I went this many days. That's amazing. I deserve to You know reward myself and that's something you can't I don't know. I just don't agree with that part um, It's okay to look back every once in a while and be like oh wow two months because that's how it should be You shouldn't be focused in on how many days um, Every single day that goes by oh my god another day um, But just focus on getting through the day um, Don't look to the future. That's my best advice um, because at first it is scary. As, as time goes on, it will become less scary because you're figuring out that, wow, I can live sober. Um, so it gets a little bit easier. But it's normal to be scared, and it's okay. Um, and if you're scared, there's a lot of good forums to go check out. Um, a lot of different ones. I've, I, something that I've been trying to do a little research on and find a few forums that I can get involved in to help encourage me. Um, there's a bunch of them. Um, I'm, I'll actually make a few videos probably on some of these sites. That'll help help some of y'all out. But uh, if you're scared, it's normal, guys. Um, we're, we need to all be here for each other. Um, I hope that eventually my channel can be more of a community in, the, in a way that, you know, we can all talk to each other on comment threads and discussions maybe on my page. And I would love to eventually, you know, develop my own website with a forum where people can come and talk and and we can encourage each other. Um, anyways, like this video. Let me comment down below if you want any additional advice on on how to, you know, not be scared of sobriety. Uh, there's, it's a complicated ordeal and it takes time. So uh, leave me a comment down below. Check out my video. I got a lot of other great videos. If you're a first-time viewer, um, and subscribe to my channel. <laughs> Thanks, guys.